again. <laughs> I just wanted to make something clear, and I probably should have really uh, put that on or wrote that in there, that I wanted to make it clear for all the newbies out there and some of my new subscribers. When you are on the protocol, Dr. Simeon's protocol, and you go into phase three, and you continue either a short round or a long round, either 21 days, 23 days, or 43 days, however you, you know, wrap that up, that in the protocol, it is very, very important when you finish a round and go into phase three to maintain your last injection weight or last dose weight, either two pounds, you don't want to go two pounds above or two pounds below in phase three. You are resetting your hypothalamus and phase three is very important. So I wanted to make that clear that I only did nine days. Four of those days were loading. So not a whole lot, you know, five days of very low calorie. And that's not a whole lot. I made a decision to end this round because I, my brain wasn't in it. And I know if I tried to force myself to continue this round, even doing it a short round, I was going to cause more problems than good. I was going to get just too frustrated and before you know it, I'm still, I have HCG in my system, and now I'm beginning to eat things I shouldn't eat on the protocol. So I know that's, that's just as dangerous to me. That's, that's what I think. So that's why I decided to get off the HCG and to go into, I'm going to call it phase three because it's, that, that's the foods I'm going to be eating is phase three. No, I'm still no sugar, still no starches, no, you know, no, no rice, no pasta, no breads. No, I'm not even doing quinoa. I'm not going to do Ezekiel bread. I'm not going to do muffins. You know, any of that thing, unless I decide to make something with uh, coconut flour and almond flour, I'm even kind of iffy on, on those. So I'm not going to rush in and start making, you know, the bowl bread or uh, the bread that's in the coffee cup. For one thing, I don't have a microwave anymore, and it is, you know, it's a pain trying to get it to cook in an oven when you just got one cup. You know, so I'm not going to do that. So I just wanted to make that clear because I didn't say it. And I thought, man, I better, because if I don't, Miss HCG girl, she's going to get on here and she's going to tell me you need to tell people that you're not on the protocol. So uh, I actually put on it phase three slash Atkins. So just wanted to let you know that my desire is to see if my body will go ahead and release weight eating phase three food. So if I'm going to go below my um, last dose weight, if I'm going to go four or five pounds below, which that would be so wonderful, if I do that, I'm not going to go ahead and start adding something in so I can get back up to the last dose weight. And I don't know. This is, this is an experiment. There, this is not something that you know I'm thinking that's going to work. I don't know. I do know that um, I needed to get my body needed to kick start, and we're going to see. And I had gained a lot of weight back, unfortunately, because I didn't step on the scale in phase three. And uh, I will never do that again. I just cannot afford to do it. If I am saying I am not going to weigh myself, someone please, you know, call me. Shout out. Make a specific vlog and tell the whole community. I'm just saying, Mimi, you said, and you're going to pay the piper. That's how I feel. So, anyway, I just wanted to get that out in the open. Now I can hurry up and download this. Yay.